today is I'm trading the top step combine uh 150k account uh June 4th and about to set a limit here Eighteen six fourteen. Eighteen six oh two point seven five. So there's my limit. Let's go ahead and set a Another limit at the target eighteen seven oh six point seven point four See where we're at. We're testing off view up right now. I'm gonna go ahead and place a position here on view up. That should be it for the positions for today. See if it holds up, get a rejection here. If not. Took out the low. All right, so I'm done for the day. And with that trade, I failed the top step evaluation. Uh, so this is about the fourth time that I've taken top step evaluation. This is by far. This may be the second best. I think. I think. Actually, I think this is the best performance I've had, at least high, high watermark, high watermark wise. Um, hitting the daily limit twice is a problem. So, there are also other problems that I've run into here that I'm going to make changes to. So, first, I want to go ahead and talk about the sample size the sample size if you want to read this you can i'll zoom in for people that want to you can pause it and read that but the major changes i'm going to be making are adjusting stop aggressively because i notice on my winners price is aggressively going into profit or immediately go, pretty much immediately going into profit we're not having uh we're not consolidating below entry point pretty much rejects and if once price reaches 10% into profit I'm going to go ahead and adjust that stop and break to break even even though I don't like to do that I ideally want to put it place it below a low 
I want to protect my profit as much as possible. So, uh, so I'm not trapped by that trailing drawdown. Um, also going to reduce my risk by 50%. So my daily stop is 1K. I don't want to hit that daily uh, stop that top step allows, which is 3K. And then my daily target is 3K. So if I hit 3K, I'm going to stop trading for the day. If I'm close to 3K, if I'm like $500 away from 3K, I'm going to stop trading for the day. I'm secure that profit and just stair set my way to the target. I'm also going to be only executing on the hours 9, 11, and 14. And I'm currently working two jobs. And the thing that I found out in my journal is I'm losing money on the days that I'm trading, on the days that I'm working, right? I have a morning job, a night job. And the on the days that I work the morning job, I'm losing, right? There's only one day that I'm not working it, working that job. And that's Thursday. And Thursday is the main day that I'm making money. So, and across the board, I'm making money on at 9, 11, and 14, 1400. So I'm going to only trade Thursdays while I'm still working both jobs and then only trade these hours on Thursday. Uh, and I'll open my, I'll open the door for more, for more trading days once I leave one of the jobs. Uh, but I'll stick to these hours and see how this works throughout this next sample size. And between those, I'll be doing other trading work to to progress and that's it so i already restarted the combine i hit the got it, got a reset so i'll be starting that uh tomorrow right because <laughs> today's wednesday and i won't be trading wednesday <laughs> all right catch you guys in the next video